Alright, we're probably gonna need to find something to, um, fill that cork up. What's this? A book? Say, it's a book about untying knots. We book. may need it later. Alright. We might as well head back up. We'll be able to trap that ghost any time now. Yeah, we already found out where the first thing is. We just need to find out where the second one is. freaking different directions we get to take. Let's take this way first. Oh look, another sea urchin. Toss the sea urchin over here, Luther. Might as well grab him. We may need him later. Oh, oops, wrong way. Oh, look at all these directions. Which way to go? I guess I'll go down here first. What is that, a flounder? Ahoy, Captain Schnitzel! How's the submarine? Going nowhere fast, <laughs> but that's okay. It gives me time to zing my z ditties. A fish is a creature that lives in the sea. It's charming and handsome. Exactly like me. Hey, nanny, nanny, and a hot cha cha. Hey, nanny, nanny, and a hot cha cha. Oh, Sebastian would be proud of that. An iceberg to the Titanic's hull did rip A surefire way to spoil a good trip Hey nanny nanny and a hot cha cha Hey nanny nanny and a hot cha cha Hey what's that? Hey look rope! Wasn't that part of the thing we needed? Things... May we have that rope for our trap, Captain Schnitzel? Yeah, you can take it, if you can untie it Even I have never been able to untie that verschluggen or not <laughs> Hey, we have a book! One. We just traded one knot for another. Oops. Great! Keep going like this and the rope will be untied. Gosh! We're not at. Whoops! Now we're. Keep going like. Jeepers! That can't be right. Whoops! We'll never... Hey, look! Whoops! Uh... Oh. Oops, glitch! Who the... Oops, glitch! Looks like we're on the right track! That can't be right. Let's see if we can find the We're not Whoops, let the knot's getting looser. Oops, let's see if we can find the Jeeper. Who the fuck? Wow! Alright, let's uh one, two, three. Oops. 
Oops. Click. Good work. We'll never get... God. Wow. We just traded one knot for another. Whoops. Let's see if we can find the matching knot in the book. Then let's untie the knot by numbers. Good work! Keep going like this and the rope great! Yay! Aha! Figured it out! Now we have the rope we need for our trap. We need to get four more things to make okay, our Okay, so trap. I had to find the shape and then... Oh, I get it. I had to use the book, find the shape, and then do it by numbers. That's what it was for. <laughs> wow. I am like the most unobservant person in the world. Whoever. One down, four to go. I'm on a slight roll today. Oil. Underwater? Hey, Freddy! It looks like we struck oil! Non-toxic biodegradable oil, to be exact. So how do you like it? I call it the wet look. Just toss the oil over here. How can you use oil in the water? You know what, I really should be asking logic in a game where two fish talk and all this random stuff happens. <laughs> Alright, let's move up. Goodbye, Pete. Goodbye, Popeye Pete guy. Let's go through here next. Uh, hi there, Mr. Eel. I assume you're Neil. Ah! Yep, you're Neil. Nobody but nobody gets past Eddie the Eel. I'm in a bad mood because I missed lunch, and you ain't improving things any. Better skedaddle or I might just eat you and toss down your little green pal for dessert. Uh. We have three purple sea urchins. Hmm, looks like I'll have to find something that he'll like. So I'll have to come back with something for him to eat. But you know, dude, it's not my fault you missed lunch. You should have found some. I mean, when I skip breakfast every day, I don't blame anyone else. Oh, what's this? My vest is on my head, sure improve my view. They make it quite clear that I may see you. I think it's quite obviously clear to see. My glasses help improve my ocularity. Wow, so many musical numbers in this. I've invented a pill that contains all the knowledge of a 50-volume encyclopedia. Only problem is, it's a really big pill. A science magazine and glasses to read it with. Ah, life is good. I would question how a fish is wearing glasses, but this is humongous entertainment we're talking about I'd have here. won first prize at the science fair if I hadn't accidentally dematerialized the judges. Oh dear. Oh, hey, hey. uh, Luther, are you okay? feeling there's more in there that we could look at. Down this way. Oh, 
Okay, I guess that's it then. Let's move on. Oh look! A pipe. These are the things we need to find to tr That pipe could be useful. Worm. Worm in the ocean. Oh, come on! I always wondered how it'd feel to get your head caught in a pipe. And now I know! It feels bad! Hey, could you folks kindly help me get this pipe off my head? It would be our pleasure, sir! Paul! Oh, Luther! Harder! Paul, man! Harder! Any harder in my air bladder's gonna pop out my nose! Could you lend a fin to get this thing off my head? We'll try, Tucker. Keep oh, pulling! Luther, give it all you've got! This is all I've got! Maybe we could try oiling it up? A drop of oil might do the trick. Oh, there we go. I don't think this is a good time sure for I do. It was just stuck in my shell. Whew. Are we glad Whew. you're okay? Thanks to you, kids. Maybe I should have tried chasing worms in a different area. Thanks for getting that pipe off my head. But I can use that for the cork. My, Tucker, your shell certainly is shiny today. That's because I just got it waxed. I can, I can try it on that cork, maybe if we attach it. I'll try it later, though. I want to look around a little more. Oh, looky, look, another urchin. And the trident! Look, there's another purple sea urchin we can add to our collection. Okay, let's get that trident. That statue is holding the trident. Just what we need for our trap. Hey, this statue is really attached to that trident, isn't it? It's not that, Luther. The trident is being blocked by the ceiling. These are my plastic coated safety scissors. These are my plastic coated safety scissors. Looks like we'll have to come back with something to either get that ceiling cracked up or get the Triton thing off. Just when I thought we could get the next part to our trap, there's always something. Let's look around a little more. Ooh, what's that? Mmm, chocolate-covered worm doodles. Oh, my favorite. Nasty. Luther, no. You'll get hooked. Huh? Hooked on junk food? No, I mean there's a fishing hook stuck into that worm doodle. Freddy, you saved my life. What could I ever do to repay you? Stop overacting. Hmm. If we use our fins to take the worm doodle off the fishing hook, we could get hurt. Then let's use if some scissors. If we use scissors. our fins to take the worm doodle off the fishing hook, we could get hurt. I'll bet these scissors will do the trick. Luther, we need to save the rest for later. I guess you're right, Freddy. Boy, oh, I bet I could give that to the eel. You know the people up above are like, How the heck did the, we lose our hook? <laughs> it's every day you get to see a fish cut off the hook. Oh, wait a minute. Was there another way I could go? Oh 
Oh look, the fishing boat's gone. Yeah, it's nice to know that in this universe there are still people that fish for hunt for fish and probably eat them. That's kind of a scary thought, isn't it? And this is a kid's game. Okay, we'll come back for that triton later. I wanna give this gummy worm to the eel. 